Well, this is undoubtedly a proud dad moment because I'm joined with, of course, the founder of Cornbury, David Howden, and indeed daughter Jemima, who's been competing. Yeah. How did it go? So, so much fun. Amazing to be here. And with all the support from everyone, couldn't have done it without you guys. Um, dressage was interesting, but a great clear cross country to finish. Um, and of course, an amazing course. So yeah, loved it. And proud dad, no <laughs> doubt, just watching Jemima in action on all three phases here on home soil, quite literally. Yeah, no, very, very, very proud moment. And of course, as you know, a very relieved moment when they get home <laughs> safely from the cross country. And I guess it's, it's a double pride because as as you know, one thing I really want to do is be there for the young horses and the young riders. And this is a proper young rider, actually on a young horse as well, who was a complete nightmare on the dressage, as you might have said. Uh, <laughs> and it's lovely baby. to see them actually learning from it, experiencing from it, and also coming up with a huge smile on her <laughs> face, which is really what matters the most, I guess. And I guess very proud of Dad, because there's no doubt he's got such a vision for Cornbury. And, uh, you know, what a fantastic couple of days. Yeah, such an amazing few days. I can't believe Dad properly got it going again. You know, I remember him saying, we're going to get the event going. I thought, God. And then last year, in the kind of trailblazer Cornbury, I thought, oh, might compete. Never ended up happening. And this year, to be doing the two starts, just amazing. And with everything you've done, I'm super proud. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about this very special horse then of yours. <laughs> so I got him over from Ireland, from Joseph Murphy, when he was a six year old. Um, he was claimed to be very experienced, said my aunt. Um, Miranda, my sister, who's a brilliant <laughs> horses. And the reason I started riding in the first place is they got too many horses for these girls and that's why I had to start riding, but carry yeah. on. So claimed to be very experienced. Um, Little did we know he was still very much a baby, still acts like a six-year-old now, but he's great fun. Um, and he's come on so much. I, my trainer said to me yesterday, when I was going to do my dressage test, he said, remember just a year ago today, you were cantering around your first novice test on the wrong leg and you didn't even know it. So <laughs> I'm pretty happy to be here you know today, now? <laughs> knowing what cantilene I want. So it's good. And he's yeah. half Connemara, isn't he? He's half bony. Yeah. Half, half, yeah, Irish hunter, little Connie, so we're very proud of him. But Dave, this is really reinforces the fact, we've spoken about this, that, you know, you want Cornbury to be that arena to bring on the younger horses and riders, which is what you've alluded to, and proof in the pudding with your very own flesh and blood here. Ab absolutely, Sam, and that's exactly what it's about, as I say. A, a, a double for me, you know, young rider and a young horse both getting experience, enjoying actually the whole atmosphere of what being an international event's like and just look today at the spectacle of this amazing show jumping arena behind us and we've got the you know, crowds coming out today enjoying Cornbread is best and I must say I'm a, I'm a very happy man today. I'm very happy that she did so well and got her first two star yeah, here. Thank you. Well you should be very very proud of her. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you both oh, for joining Sam. us. Thank Brilliant. you. Thank you.